This is a demonstration of the pick test, which can be used to determine if fungus has begun to attack wood members. What we do is punch the point of an awl or other sharp object. You can use a thin flat bladed screwdriver or the blade of a pocket knife. And we jam the point of the instrument into the grain of the wood and pry upwards. And if we get a nice long sliver of wood like this that has been pried up in an earlier test and it makes a good splintering sound as we're doing that then we've we've got sound wood in that location on the other hand if the tool breaks the wood if, if the wood breaks right over the tool when it's, it's pried up that's an indication that fungal decay has begun and you need to replace the member. So we're going to try this a couple of times. We should get a nice splintering sound in the good wood. So we'll try that right here. So that was a great splintering sound. This is a good portion of the wood here. Let's try it again on the, the side of the member. So we got a nice chunk of wood that, that peeled away, away from where I ins inserted the tool. So that's a good indication for us. Try one more time. And again, it, it broke away from where I inserted the tool. And we'll go back to our nice silvery aged wood, which you might find in a deck and see what happens when we pry up here. We just get a very small chunk of wood, uh, no splintering noise. Again, another small chunk of wood. Getting a little bit of splintering, but again, it's, it's breaking right over the tool. So that's an indication that we have the beginning of fungal de decay and this member should be replaced if it's a structural component of the building. One of the problems with fungal decay is that be by the time a trained specialist can detect it under a microscope, the wood has lost possibly as much as 50% of its strength. So the the way that the fungus attacks the wood is very stealthy and very dangerous. So wood decay is nothing to uh, take lightly.